Hi everyone, thanks for joining me. Uh, as we all know, we are now waiting for uh, the airing of Punisher season two. Uh, so I'm just a little bit excited uh, because Punisher is one of my favorite characters. And uh, so just to kill my time until Netflix uploads all the episodes, uh, I decided to do a little bit of action figure photography. So as you can see behind me, uh, you oh, have always seen these bookshelves, uh, but these are not uh, exactly bookshelves. Yes, they are being used for uh, storage, but I'm planning to make a full-fledged action figure studio uh, with uh, a lot of the equipment that's needed to give it a real, uh, you know, feel of the Marvel Universe so what has happened is that uh, I have uh, been able to uh, lay the groundwork for it but now uh, slowly and steadily I'm gonna be starting uh, this pro project and hopefully will be entertaining you all with my completed action figure studio that's gonna be ha having a glimpse of the Marvel Universe so uh, as you can see, the thing is that uh, what I'm doing is the fact that uh, I'm trying to recreate uh, a section of uh, Manhattan with these, you know, buildings. There's a lot of uh, junk right now in my room at the moment, but I have to clean it up entirely so just I created an, a scenario uh, which is like uh, slightly related to the net Netflix universe but uh, with a with, uh, with a special guest appearance from the Marvel uh, universe whether they are Netflix whether they are cinematic universe so as you can see I have this action figure of uh, Punisher this is a Marvel Legends toy biz uh, action figure that came in as part of the Marvel uh, Marvel Urban Legends uh, action figure set. Uh, so I'm trying to show Frank Castle standing in the middle on a street in New York, uh, mostly Manhattan. And then, since Punisher and Spider Man go a long way back, uh, both of them are recognized as urban legends within the Marvel Universe. I'm talking about the comic books. So I place Spider-Man here. Uh, and uh, then I have uh, Daredevil and Elektra. Uh, so, I mean, I really find it comforting uh, to use my action figures in this way. And, uh, you know, recreating all the scenes uh, the imaginary fights or maybe some fights that took place uh, in the Marvel Universe. I really feel good. Uh, I'm sure there are a lot of people like me out there who are um, into action figure photography and action figure decoration. Basically once this gets completed this will be my full-fledged action figure studio so on one side uh, I'll be having these uh, shelves decorated as buildings and on the other side uh, they are going to be decorated with action figurines uh, some of them you're going to see hanging all the way from the top to give them a swinging feeling or a flying feeling like for example if there's spider-man so i want to give it like or daredevil that they are swinging across buildings in manhattan just like they do in the comics and then at the same time if there is like captain marvel or uh, falcon or uh, heroes that fly so i'm going to be using those as well so this is just a small clip i just wanted to make uh, just to share my uh, favorite pastime with all of you. Hope you guys enjoyed. 
subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for further updates for any superhero related activity in Jeddah. Thank you for joining. Bye. Have a nice weekend.